it's Tamika Mosley, and today I want to talk about staying crisis free during the winter months. There's been a lot of people who are actually taking even flow who's going into a crisis, and I want to kind of explain to people uh, during the winter months the things that we need to do to stay crisis free. It is extremely cold in a lot of places right now, and the body will go into shock. And we know that people with sickle cell disease extreme changes in the temperature can throw you into a crisis. We also know that if a person get an infection, it can also throw that person into a crisis as well. So during the winter months, it's very, very important that you up the doses of your even flow. A lot of you know that when I uh, talk about my son Aiden, he's playing sports, he's swimming, he's overexerting himself. On these days, he's doing all of that. I make sure I give him not one even flow, but I give him four or five even flows that day. And the reason I do that is because I want to make sure that his body continues to keep up producing enough red blood cells to carry oxygen throughout the body. Same thing for the, for the uh, winter months. It's extremely cold right now. This is a time when a lot of people are getting the flu shots. I, mean, I don't get the flu shots for my kids, but a lot of times... Um, uh, people get the flu shots and then they end up getting sick after they get the, the flu shot. So you have a lot of sickness, a lot of infections, a lot of germs going around right now, and a lot of people are getting sick. So you want to make sure that you keep your immune system strong. You want to make sure you're taking your natural antibiotics. If you have Virid from Healing Blends Global, which is a great, great natural antibiotic, you can take that on a daily basis. You can also take uh, five, 6,000 milligrams of vitamin C every day. You can take garlic capsules every day. Uh, you can do any of these, but you wanna make sure that you keep your immune system strong so you don't get sick, and you wanna make sure you take enough of even flow that is gonna keep your body producing red blood cells consistently. So just want to stop by and let everybody know to up the doses on the even flow if you feel yourself going into a crisis, immediately, immediately, you have to start taking even flow every hour. So that's one capsule every hour at the first sign that you feel pain. If you do that, the quicker you will get out of the crisis. It will, it will never escalate to level 10 pain. The longer you wait to start taking even flow every hour, the longer it's gonna take for you to get out of the crises. For example, if you wait until your level eight, level nine, level 10 pain to start doing even flow every hour, it's gonna take probably 24 hours for you to come out of the crises. But don't worry, you will come out of it. Just continue to take even flow every hour around the clock. And you can take up to 20 capsules in a 24 hour, uh, 24 hour period. And if you continue to, to do this, you will definitely come out of the crises. But anyway, hope that helps. And if you have any questions, you can definitely leave some comments below and talk to you guys soon. Thanks.